again. <laughs> I give birth to my twins already. <laughs> but I'm still here for more. And you know I'm always excited when it's about food, right? The last time we had reddish cake and all that stuff, and red yam brown rice, and I'm just so excited. So what's next in, with this uh, program? Mm, I am bringing you to Malacca. M Malacca? What's there in Malacca? Okay, I'm teaching you how to make um, pong te today. Pong te? What, what kind of dish is that? Um, it's traditionally cooked with pork, but today we are going to cook with chicken. Like I say guys, when there's pork, there's happiness, but hey, there's chicken too. So I can't wait, I'm super excited. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yes. All right. So Annie, what do we have with us here today? Okay, today I'm going to teach you how to make a nyonya dish. Nyon, Bapa nyonya? Yeah. Wow, I am, I am excited. What, what, what dish is this? This is a pong te. Normally, pong te, they will okay. use it uh, on pork. Pork, oh wow. But today we are going to make it halal, so we are going to use chicken. Okay. Chicken pong te. Chicken works too, right? Yes. Okay, so what are the ingredients that we have here? The ingredients are 500 grams of chicken drumstick and wings cut into pieces and marinated with one tablespoon of corn flour for 30 minutes or longer. 200 grams of potatoes, skin peeled and cut into chunks. 12 cloves of garlic, skin peeled and minced. 5 shallots, skin peeled and minced. 1 red bird's eye chili, 2 tablespoons of cooking oil. 5 dried mushrooms, soaked to soften, drain, stem removed and cut into half. And for the sauce, we have 350 ml water, 100 grams of fermented bean paste, 2 tablespoons of sugar, 1 teaspoon of dark soy sauce, and half teaspoon of white pepper powder. Cornstarch, one tablespoon of corn flour mixed with one tablespoon of water. Okay, we need to first saute this. Saute first, right, okay. Oh, before that, don't forget the oil, okay? Okay, first we need to saute this uh, minced garlic and shallots. All right. So like, what, what's the fire temperature like? What, what do you normally um, Normally, I will use a medium fire. Medium fire, okay. That's good to know. Saute this until it's fragrant. Mm. Then we'll dump everything in. Dump everything? Yeah. I think that's my favourite part where you just <laughs> put everything that's out here and just poop all inside. Yes. This is cornstarch, right? Cornstarch will be the last item we, do, you, last we put in. The last item, okay. Guys, I'm not kidding you. Every episode with Annie, seems like the dish gets simpler and simpler. Man, I got what I wanted, you know? Simple yet complex kind of dish, you know what I'm saying? Oh wow, look at that. This looks okay, right? Yeah. And the smell, is, the aroma is just coming out from the pan, just sizzling it in there. Yes. Right, so what comes after that? Okay, we put the sauce in first. We put the sauce in. You want to okay. tell them what's in the sauce maybe? Okay, this is mainly um, tau chu, you know, bean paste. Bean paste, okay. Yes. Um, sugar. Alright. A bit of a dark soy sauce for the colour. Alright. Yeah, that's all. That's all? Yeah. Wow, three magical ingredients in one bowl. And look at that happy bowl just pouring in. Guys, make sure you want to give it a good stir, you know, for all the sugar too, right? Yeah. And all the bean paste and everything to go out. Ooh. Look at that goodness. Okay, then we can put in our chicken. Oh, wow. So normally when you put in the chicken, like, what is the best part of the chicken that you would normally recommend people, uh, oh, people to get? My children loves the drumstick part. Of course. The dark meat part. I mean, which children don't enjoy drumstick, right? Yeah. So, okay, drumsticks and wings, I'm supposed, right? Yeah. Okay. And after the chicken is the potatoes. Yes, and then the, finally the mushrooms. Ooh, nice. So we let this braise until the potatoes soften and the chicken is cooked. So we're not going to put in the cornstarch? No, that yet. will be final. Final, okay. So we're going to put it on for about how long? Eh? This will take about 15 minutes to cook. 15 minutes, okay. Wow, look at it, Annie. Yeah, full of sauce. It's. It's so saucy. I don't know if you guys know this song, but raw sauce, no ketchup. <laughs> children will love this with their rice. Oh man, I, I don't even talk about children. I would love this with my rice. Wow. So what's next? Uh, are we going to add in the corn flour now? Yeah, we are oh, going right. to add in the cornstarch now. Guys, it smells amazing. Seriously. Well, look at it. So what does the cornstarch do in the... Mm, just to thicken the sauce a little bit. Just to thicken the sauce, right? Alright. And yeah, guys, it's just amazing how she can make all this magic in one pot. So, all you gotta do is just cook some rice and wait for this to simmer and voila! So again, guys, 
I know there's a lot of ingredients in there and you're trying to figure it out. Don't worry, we have all the ingredients on her website and it's all online. So you can figure it out all by yourself. And don't worry, it's simple, right? Yes. So again, that's all we have for you today. My name is Nathaniel. I'm Annie. Goodbye. Bye. See ya.